I would really, really love to take a bubble bath, but I'm scared I would get a disease. Uh, that is one of the exfoliating. Yeah, what, what is she exfoliating to have it this color? It's so rare. Oh. When Tarita's is on a case, she never rests, cause there's no room to. Bedroom. Oh, God. I would be the best private investigator if I could get my life organized. The clutter has taken over. I'm at a loss. How did she sleep in it like God this? God knows. Uh, where did she get in it? Where did she get out of it? Come on, Aggie. Let's get out of here. Walk. Time for Kim and Aggie to shake down this shabby Sherlock. But they haven't a clue what's become of her. Where the heck is she? I don't know, but I'm getting very annoyed. I'm going to ring her up. I'm fed up with this. Hello? Hi, it's Kim and Aggie here. Where are you? I'm on a stakeout. Well, can you get over here now, please? Okay, I'll be there right now. Thank you. Well done. Sorry, I'm late. I'm the dirt detective. And I'm the immaculate inspector. Ooh. Get in here. Yes, ladies? Now you stand there, well-groomed, and you live in muck. Yeah. So you've got time for all this. Oh, naturally. But no time for naturally. the rest of it. I'm never here. What about that bathroom? It's hideous. You don't use the shower, obviously, because that's no. full of stuff. Yeah. And the bath itself, how did it get so black? Is that um, hair dye or dirt? Uh, not hair dye. No, come so on, it's natural. Dirt. Well, right, I'm a natural blonde, you know. <laughs> Have you looked in your bird food lately? It's crawling. Oh. It, you must know that. What did you feed that bird on? I have him eating other stuff over on the side. So do you want to get clean? I desperately do. I think that once I have my home mm -hmm. in order, mm -hmm. I can actually welcome clients in mm -hmm. or friends and family. Fine. Let's do Come it. Come on, let's do it. The first phase of this inside job is to declutter. Oh, this is marvelous. So Tarita's got to declassify old documents and ditch the debris. Now Inspector Woodburn and her Dr. Watson have to hunt down their cleaning clothes. Any good gumshoe can pick a lock, but only Aggie knows how to disinfect one. Look at this shiny, gleaming doorknob. I love it. It looks clean, doesn't it? Absolutely. I'm sure it's not. You're not cleaning your doorknob, are you, really? No. 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 So although it's shiny, it's going to be full of bacteria. I'm going to borrow from your profession. I'm going to take some fingerprints here just to show you what on your doorknob, even though it looks lovely and clean. <gasps> All of that. It was on there. Icky, isn't it? Ew! All you need is a wee squirt of antibacterial cleaner. You you wipe it off. That even smells good. Oh, look at it! It, it looks, looks brand new. And not only is it clean, it's free of germs. That's the most important thing. All traces of evidence gone. <gasps> They'll never know we were here. Now to erase every trace from this cloudy crystal carafe, we turn to Agent Woodburn. When you have a glass decanter or glass vase, that you get the terrible stain on the glass inside, I'll tell you what you do. Now, I'm going to put some rice, because it's a mild abrasive white vinegar, and I'm going to swirl round. What it does is the rice beats against the glass, not harming it. You know, you get stains with the wine, keeps your arms strong. Now, the marks seem to have gone. It is quick, okay. and I'm going to show you the colour of the water, my dear. Do you have to? Oh, look at the water. That's ghastly, isn't it? We'll rinse it through, and you'll be totally amazed. <gasps> And all those stains we have with all the drink are gone. Now, these are stopper off for a couple of days oh. to give any last vinegar effects that dissipate out here. So leave a couple of days, and then Bob's your uncle, fill it up again, <laughs> and get boozing merrily. Why would Kim consider this her sanitary secret weapon? Banana. And why is Aggie putting out an emergency call for help? Could you get over here right now? <laughs> Kim and Aggie are in L.A., confidentially speaking, with a striking private eye named Tarita, whose home is a grisly grime scene. So they're teaching her some top secrets for sanitizing. Tarita has two dogs, and while they may not be bloodhounds, they can still sniff out a dirty dish. This bucket I've given you is for washing your dog bowls. Now, I'm simply going to take dishwashing liquid. 
little bits. This is a very good brand. Don't buy cheap brands of washing up liquid. It doesn't pay. Now, I take the dog bowls, right? In they go. Now, you see, I find that's lovely. This is vegetable oil. Smidgen, we call it in Britain, a smidge. Now, you take your paper towel and you completely rubbing it off, literally, that's what you're doing. What happens is when your pet eats its food, cats or dogs, a little bit of oil does them good, but it means that, you know when food gets stuck on the sides? Uh -huh. It won't, it won't. So from this to that. Indeed. Amazing. By God, he's a lucky dog, isn't he? Happy dog, happy mummy. Where's the secret spot? Now Kim and Aggie call in their stealth squad of sanitizers. Freeze! To help Tarita cover her tracks. Dynamic. Wow. Watch just what we need. Come on, Axe. The cleaning agents chase down the dirt. And with just a squeeze of Febreze, our PI gets rid of PU. It's a bad smell in here, Teresa. Can you spray some of this around? It'll get rid of the bad smells and it'll freshen the air. It smells great. Yes. Now here's a case for our sexy sleuth. Kim needs her to recover some lost green stuff. I notice these plants are not at all shiny. You can buy things to put on them, but why go to all the expense? Because in most houses, you have the very thing in your hands. Banana? This has potassium in it. It feeds the plant leaves. It <gasps> makes them lovely and shiny, and the shine lasts. How so, often would you do this? I'd say about, I don't know. Once every couple of months. It looks amazing. And afterwards, for a treat, I'll give you a piece of banana. I'm a very generous woman. Thank you. Uh, and you, you can see a tremendous difference. That is not beautiful. And we did it together. It, we certainly did. Tarita's work may be dangerous, but her household gadgets shouldn't be. So Aggie's launching a high-tech probe. Tuta, do you know how disgusting this phone is? Pretty disgusting, huh? It is. It's filthy. I think we need to call in some extra help here. 